They're breathtaking, they're eye-opening, they're jaw-dropping. For the top 10 most beautiful places in the world. Before we begin, we publish new videos every day, so be sure to subscribe for more great content. For this list, we'll be looking at the most beautiful locations the natural world has to offer. Number 10, Palawan Island. Picture a place where the most intensely unnatural colors are real, where jagged rock formations seemingly drip into hopelessly clear water, surrounded by rich lagoons and richer forest, and you've pictured Palawan. Largely untouched by man, it's been voted the world's most beautiful island more than once, with its beach El Nido also topping lists. Cartoonishly colorful and psychedelically vivid, this hidden gem is accessible by plane or boat and is home to unique wildlife, including the Philippine mouse deer and purple crabs. Number 9. Seljalandsfoss These falls are among the best known in Iceland and rank among the most beautiful in the world. Part of the Seljalands River, the falls end. Their 197-foot or 60-meter drop are fed by waters from the volcanic glacier Eyjafjallajökull, a land of seemingly never-ending rainbows. Seljalandsfoss has the added bonus of a cave behind the fall's aquatic curtain, allowing visitors a surreal viewpoint. Best still, the location itself is relatively easy to access and can be seen from a nearby, well-used ring road. Fitzvitsa Lakes National Park. One of southeastern Europe's oldest national parks and a UNESCO World Heritage Site since 1979, Fitzvitsa Lakes National Park has over 73,000 acres or 297 square kilometers of something for everyone. Overflowing with waterfalls, cascades, hiking trails and limestone canyons, it's hard to know where to look, but the lakes and their vivid colors are the park's main dish. Pitvitsa actually features 16 interconnecting lakes, all of which change color thanks to minerals, organisms, and a trick of the sun. Gar de Benajú. Located on Portugal's southern coast, this seaside gem was once a fishing-based region, but today the Benajú Sea Caves draw visitors based on looks alone. It's best accessed by water, by kayak, boat, or swimming, but your efforts will be rewarded with unfathomable beauty. Like a vast cathedral of divine handiwork, this natural grotto, with its rocky walls, silky sand, and weathered skylight, is enough to make you feel small and insignificant. 
and yet protect it against everything else the world has to offer. of more. Dismantled during the Napoleonic Wars, today the only reminder of the fort for which these gorgeous cliffs were named is an old watchtower. Rising 390 feet or 120 meters at Hag's Head to a height of 702 feet or 214 meters down the coast, the cliffs are home to 30,000 birds from 20 different species, including adorable puffins. A look in any direction provides a view of other Irish dreamscapes, including the Twelve Pins Mountain Range, the Aran Islands, and the Mountain Turk Mountain. Great Barrier Reef and Whitehaven Beach. The world's largest structure made by living organisms, the Great Barrier Reef was constructed by coral. It's home to diverse aquatic species, from whales, dolphins, and clownfish, to leatherback turtles and nine kinds of seahorse. What's more, the nearby Whitehaven Beach is considered one of the planet's most beautiful and eco-friendly beaches. The coast is lined with glorious white, 98% pure silica sand, which doesn't retain heat, meaning you can walk the shore till your heart's content and never burn your feet.
Antelope Canyon. Known to the Navajo as the place where water runs through rocks, Antelope Canyon is more majestic than its name suggests. It's the product of millennia of rainfall and floods, eroding and smoothly carving deep corridors into the Navajo sandstone. But the canyon walls are only part of the attraction. The rest is sunlight, sneaking its way through the canyons and creating the appearance of fire. Naturally, summer's the best time to visit, as the light beams are more plentiful Iwasu Falls. One of the modern natural wonders of the world, this staggering waterfall system, the largest of its kind, sits on the Argentina-Brazil border, meaning big water in native languages. This natural attraction is unique in that it can be accessed from three different countries, given its additional proximity to Paraguay, because something this beautiful needs to be shared. Effectively a chain of mini waterfalls, the lion's share of the river passes over a U-shaped chasm known as the Devil's Throat. Lake. Situated just 9 miles or 14 kilometers outside the village of Lake Louise in Banff National Park, in view of the Rocky Mountains is Moraine Lake. Fed by glaciers, this rock flower blue lake was once featured on the Canadian $20 bill, earning one view the moniker the $20 view. Among the country's most photographed locations, the lake is unsurprisingly popular with hikers. It crests in late June but visitors can take in the Rockies or their reflection on Moraine Lake nearly year-round. De Uyuni. Resembling a vast, unending mirror, these are the world's largest salt flats, covering a roughly 4,100 square mile or 10,000 square kilometer area. Once a proper lake in prehistoric times, today the flats are made of a 10 billion ton layer of salt, under which sits between 50 to 70 percent of the world's lithium reserves. Sparse in terms of vegetation and wildlife, the almost unnaturally level flats are also packed with chemicals like magnesium, potassium, and borax. But more importantly, they're eerily beautiful.